Hey everyone, it's Mr. Square John with the video response and uh, to a contest that Chavez Chavez 556 has going on. It's a really nice appreciation contest he's got. He's got. Um, I just subbed the guy recently, maybe about a week ago, and found out he had a contest. So uh, it's real nice of him to do that. Um, I never win contests, so I just enroll them just as an excuse to upload videos. So all he re all he uh, demands for this one is a EDC showcase, something new in the EDC, and a shout out. I'm not sure what kind of shout out, anyone specific or any channel specific, but I'm gonna do something relative to this kind of stuff. So anyway. Simply, this is the EDC uh, knives. I'll switch out, um, rotate. Um, let's see. So let's start with the knives. Actually, for example, right now I am carrying a uh, nine-dollar Winchester made. Well, ch Chinese with the slap of Winchester. So uh, can't really see it. It's real old. Lasted me three years already. This knife is great. Uh, frame is like completely steel. Uh, unlike a lot of cheap knives uh, that are around nine dollars, there'll be gaps in between the handle and all that. There are no gaps whatsoever. This is just like pretty much a great, a great frame. It's a uh, liner lock, and it's. I have confidence that this knife will stay open whenever I open it. Serration is still really good. The edge, uh, sharp on both, it's not chisel, so sharp on both sides. Um, the still is just stainless steel. Lock is strong. Uh, clip is very strong. Uh, what else? Little thumbnails are a little, thumb studs are a little loose, and it's the only problem, but that's. You know, no biggie for me. If it's not that, it's uh, the Gerber mini frame or mini pair frame. It's pretty cool. I like it. Uh, just came with inside a little Bear Grylls Chivo survival kit. Yeah, a spinner. If it's not that one, it's this other Winchester made. I bought this little lock back uh, to give a test trial to see if I enjoy these kind of knives. The, I was thinking of getting a buck, a miniature buck. Um, so there's that. The brass is real cheap. Uh, it runs off. The wood is okay. It's nice. The nice knife that's sharp. I've cut myself because I was stupid. Um, the lock is pretty good. Uh, but overall, I just you know don't feel very secure with it. So I try not to use it very often. But it's a good knife. Um, the wallets. Well, you know what? We'll just stick with this. No, no, no. Wallet. It's a lamb wallet made out of lamb skin. I only got it because of the coin purse. Um, that's why I, I was forced to get a lamb skin wallet. Nice wallet. It's bifold. It's leather. And there's that one. Or when I just want to go light, I carry a ID holder. Got a notebook full of little notes. I like writing down notes for whatever. Um, flight and Terry's and what else? Just books I want to read, movies I want to read, budgets, just uh, phone numbers, you know. Handy. Fossil. Love this watch. It's a gift for my birthday. It was really, uh, it's a, such a nice watch. I love it. It's really beautiful. Not beautiful. It's just really nice. It's leather. I, I enjoy brown. Um, for the sunny days, I have a brown hat. It's a $4 hat from the thrift store. Yeah, kind of gross, but, you know, it was really cool. I like going to thrift stores. For the sunnier days, I got some shades. Um, what are these, like, aviator shades? I don't know. Pilot shades. They're cool. Looks like a... I don't know. I like them. Nothing fancy. They were just, what, dockers for, like, 20 bucks. Surprisingly, I spend 20 bucks on that. 
Uh, got a little Swiss mini chomp whenever I need it. I like to, you know, combine this one with whatever I'm carrying because, you know, it's a little multi-tool for small jobs. Got a little pen in case I don't have my pen, my main pen. The, uh, uh, stupid little tweezers. Stupid little thing. Uh, no filer. Oh, this is a, what is it? Not the stupid little thing, but it's a, uh, Uh, you push down your uh, cuticles. Kind of weird, huh? And I just use it for the kind opener and the scissors, really. Pen. It's either this one, but this is a uh, Lancelot pen. 12 bucks. I have no idea why I bought it. It's a crazy amount for a pen. I've seen way higher prices, but that's kind of odd anyway. Anywho, I had to modify this ink because I ran out of the original ink, ink canister or whatever ink refill thing. This is a pilot ink refill. I had to cut it down because it didn't fit. So that's doing its job. It was just a gel pen. I should have just bought a gel pen. When it's not that, it's this. It's one of those cool little pens. Uh, writes pretty poorly, but it has a little blade. I like that. It was pretty cool. Cheap blade, but I doubt it's going to penetrate any stabbing, at least more than once. Uh, Self-defense wise. Um, Meritex flashlight got three modes on it. Perfect for just you know throwing in my pocket and my phone. Oh yeah, and I rotate. I'm thinking of using this one for a while. Giving it a shot. Gerber profile. It's good. It has a good edge. I like to use it for. Um, I actually I hardly use it. I love the grip though. I put a little liner around it. I use this. I really only wear this when I'm going out to. Uh, Deter any would-be thugs. Wear this around my waist, and you know, uh, hopefully that gets them. If not, I hope I'd hate to use it. I don't really know how to use knives in a self-defense mode, <laughs> um, other than just like you know, slash and stab and uh, prison stance. You know, just you uh, get your knife. You know, ready to go. You got it. You just hunch down and get ready to, you know, go for the kill. Uh, other than that, you know, no real actual defense. But if it's real life scenario, uh, mirror, then you go for the kill. Um, that's really a tough thing to do. Anyway, this is going beyond what I wanted it to do. Anywho, so also I carry sunflowers. I love sunflowers. So, sunflower seeds. Something new I carry would have to be some basswood and a whittling knife. Um, I enjoy whittling actually, but I haven't really made much, or I haven't created much, haven't whittled much, but I like it. It's, it's fun. You gotta discover what is inside each little block of wood. Um, shout out would have to go to... Hmm... Probably someone who needs the help with subscribers, but I don't really know any amateur and amateur people. But one guy, in particular gentleman, sticks out. Very cool guy, cool dude. I like him. He's down to earth. And one of us, Mr. T One's one. I enjoy the guys. He's cool. Well, I like watching his videos. Um, uh, so. He's probably going to do a review on his EDC, um, if he hasn't already. I wouldn't doubt it. That guy's crazy. He's always on YouTube. Not always on YouTube, but he's a good guy. Go and give him your support. You'll need it. He's a great guy, actually. He's really, he, he's, he's very uh, optimistic. I love that. Also, I carry a bandana. Multiple purposes. And really, that is it. If I'm not carrying this in my pocket, I'll use a little mini organizer, Maxpedition. Or I'll just leave some of this out. So that's it. Hope this wasn't too long. Thank you again, Mr. Travis Chavez, for a contest entry. Hopefully, you get what you're looking for. Um, yeah, you'll, you'll do cool. You'll do fine. You'll be good. All right. Thank you, and I will see you guys later.